Hi, I'm Marshall with FUN. Uh, I'm here with Team 6502 Dark Side from Durham, North Carolina at the Asheville District event. So uh, why don't we start, uh, you guys tell me a little bit about your robot. All right, so this year our robot Backfire uh, is kind of a general purpose hatch panel and cargo bot. We decided to kind of go try and do everything, but uh, as the seasons progressed, we've moved towards focusing on just getting hatch panel in level one and two and uh, what, uh, cargo ship locked down. So how have you improved your hatch paneling from say the start of your season until now? One of the, well, one of the most important things that we've done in my opinion is we've added a limelight um, and that's really improved our hatch panel because one of the things that was mo hardest at the beginning of the competition um, was really lining up with a hatch panel and the loading station. Um, the limelight allowed us to really um, start to do that in a more automated way which makes absolutely everything much faster. Um, and the hatch panel mechanism also means that we don't drop hatch panels. Instead of actuating out and dropping them, it just goes down with a hatch panel. So if we don't actually get it on the rocket ship or the cargo ship, um, then it doesn't matter. We can just try again. We don't have to try and pick one up again. Yeah. Very cool. And another thing to add about that is not only does it help us in driver assist in teleop, but it also can help us in auto as well. Um, and so we find it's been really helpful. So even if we do have an auto code, um, we know that sometimes the field can be maybe an inch off from what we actually expected it to be because that's just something you have to take into account. And the limelight can help with those small changes in the fields. Very cool. So uh, you guys, obviously, third season now for you guys. So And it's been tremendous watching you progress through the last couple of years. What are you guys doing outside of building a robot that's interesting and cool this year? So um, for outreach, one of the things that we love, love, love to do is the botanical gardens. And so um, we took a Dropkick there last year and we showed it um, around to kids. And one of the things that that organization helps with is they take um, science experiments to hospitals for kids that normally wouldn't be able to do that stuff. And they make it accessible to kids that um, maybe wouldn't have the opportunity to do that otherwise. And that's one of our favorite things to do. And then also um, not actually building our robot, but just for training our teams. One of the things we started this year was winter workshops. Um, and we know as a new team that can be um, really helpful towards the development with years to come so yeah very cool if you guys had one thing to say to a new t a rookie team what would it be use chief delphi and discord for sure <laughs> like just that's, that's it, everyone on discord and everyone on chief delphi is more than willing to help you out i'm on there a bunch uh if you have any questions at all just go there uh it's great and also just teams, just ask teams questions. I mean, teams would love to help you and give you advice. And First is such a great community and yeah. yeah people, awesome. People enjoy helping you on, on those sites. Like it's, it's what people love to do. Well, very cool. Guys, uh, thank you very much for taking the time to speak with us. So good luck this season and uh, we'll see you guys out there. We need your help to keep fun loud, live and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.